This is Leila Torres from OrigamiSpirit.com. We are going to be folding this flower, which is about three inches in diameter. And for this flower, we'll need a paper six by six inches. For the demonstration, I will be using a paper which is seven by seven inches. Duo color. If we want the flower to be light color like this, we are going to begin on the darker side of the paper. First, we will fold the diagonals. Then we are going to fold the central lines which are parallel to the borders. Now we are going to bring this edge to the center and this edge to the center. Rotate and repeat with these two borders. Turn over the paper and now we are going to bring one corner to the center. Then we bring the same corner to this intersection. We are going to repeat with the other three corners. Now we are going to identify this diagonal that comes from this point to this point. We are going to fold on that diagonal and then we are going to fold following this central line. Push here and collapse. Turn over now we are going to follow this fold and push the paper from the back and from here, from the sides and collapse. Now we pick up the paper and locate these central flaps and we are going to push from this side, push it in and inside reverse fold. Now we are going to insert our finger here and pinch this corner Then this triangular flap, we are going to reverse it as well. We're going to repeat here. Turn the paper over and repeat on these two sides. Now we open this flap so that we have a square base. Turn it over 
and we're going to be picking up these points so that they stand up and they are perpendicular to the base. Now we insert our finger and flatten each flap. Now we bring each one of these folded borders to this central line. We repeat on the other three flaps. Once they are all folded like this, we are going to reopen them. And now we are going to bring this corner to the center. And we are going to repeat the same with the three other flaps. Now notice that there will be an um, intersection from the previous fold at these two points. We are going to fold this corner up so that this border coincides with that point. We're going to repeat on the other three sides. We're going to go back to the folds that we previously made and we're going to refold extending the line over these folds. Now for each one of these flaps, we are going to locate a packet. And we're going to open inserting our fingers and then to this point we are going to make a little fold to the back so that we round it And we are going to repeat the same with the other six flaps. And our flower is all finished. We can add a little pin, in this case I have a self-sticking pin, to the back of the flower and make a great origami fashion statement. Thank you, this is Leila Torres from OrigamiSpirit.com. Subscribe to Origami Spirit YouTube channel and receive alerts for upcoming origami tutorials.